I'm Jerry Mitchell. I'm an investigative reporter from the Clarion Ledger in Jackson, Mississippi. Back in 1989, I happened to go see the movie Mississippi Burning, which is a fictional movie about the uh, killings, 1964 killings, of James Cheney and Andy Goodman and Mickey Schwerner, who were three civil rights workers. They were killed by the Ku Klux Klan. And I really knew nothing about that case, other than the barest of details. And I saw the movie, and I was just very outraged at what, what had happened, and especially the fact that you know, these killings had, had gone unpunished. And so that kind of began my journey, I guess you could say, into, into looking into these old cases. And so here I am now, more than 20 years later, and I'm still <laughs> looking into these cases. It wasn't like I, you know, I had everybody out there like cheering me on. It was quite the opposite. I had quite a number of phone calls, people calling me, you know, what are you doing writing about this dead N-word and things like that as I began to look at that case and other cases. But, but gradually over time, it kind of took on an impetus of its own, you know, way beyond me. Here are these families that have gone decades and decades uh, without justice. And to see these guys actually convicted, these killers convicted, and to see these families just weep tears of, of happiness, really, uh, as these guys go away. I, I mean, to me, that's, that's the biggest reward that I've received in, in all my career. Uh, receiving the MacArthur Fellowship is, is just amazing. I, I'm still sitting here stunned <laughs> that I received it, but it, it's going to make it possible for me to basically be able to devote uh, my full-time energies to, to these cases and these stories. I really still believe there, that journalism is that noble profession, that we can expose injustices where they take place. We can bring light to the darkness, and it's, it's an important job, and we need journalism now, I think, more than ever.